curiosity is really what gets science going. And I think that's fundamental in driving science forward. I still remember the first patient I had working in the ICU that was living with HIV and he was undetectable. And at that moment, I was inspired. To me, the long-term success of my research would mean that people with HIV are living a similar lifespan and a health span as people without HIV. People don't seem to realize that just last year, there were almost 700,000 people dying from completely preventable HIV-related deaths. Initially, when I was working on my dissertation, um, I was looking at the vaginal microbiome. The early work in that area um, showed that Black women have bad bacteria and white women have good bacteria. And so I was determined to figure out what was really going on and move beyond just the description of Black women have this and white women have that. I would see patients come into the hospital that appeared 10 to 15 years older than their peers without HIV and were experiencing frailty and fractures and things that I wouldn't expect. So the reason I do research is to help the community that I'm serving. Service is huge for me. My work focuses on the social cultural influences like your family members or media or your peers that influence the sexual health behaviors that women are practicing. Having the mobile unit, we can go to the people versus them having that barrier of trying to come to us to get testing. My research focuses on targeting the latent HIV virus. We use an innovative approach to try and eliminate this latent virus by causing these cells that contain this virus to self-destruct. We want to help improve the physical function of people as they're aging with HIV to be able to still participate in activities that they find important and meaningful in their life. When you're tackling big issues, you need to work together because a single lab is not going to be able to do it. The Gilead RSP, or Research Scholars Program, really strives to meet an unmet need in research by funding investigators in settings that might not typically be funded, as well as funding new research that can lead to breakthroughs and innovative new interventions and clinical care models. To have funding for your ideas means that you have the means to be able to answer these really important questions. You have that extra financial support to explore the things that you're curious about and potentially serve as a foundation for the rest of your research career. What makes me most hopeful for the future of combating HIV is the energy of many, many different people who don't lose sight of why it is important. I would love to create a safe space for Black women in particular to be able to talk about sex, to be more positive about sex, and therefore reduce their risk of HIV and STIs. Any intervention that we develop needs to be uh, available uh, and effective in all populations globally for people with HIV.